Welcome back to the channel where we explore, learn, and theorize about the Marvel Universe. Today we're going to be talking about Keanu Reeves as Kraven the Hunter in Spider-Man 3, how Electro could set up the live-action Spider-Verse movie, and how Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness will further expand on it and fix the problems caused by Scarlet Witch in WandaVision. If you're new to the channel, I do daily Marvel videos, so be sure to subscribe to never miss out. Now let's get started. As you all probably heard yesterday, the Hollywood Reporter stated that Jamie Foxx's Electro will appear in Spider-Man 3. And if you remember, Jamie Foxx played Electro in 2014's The Amazing Spider-Man 2. However, like with J.K. Simmons in Far From Home, this is going to be a completely different version. And Jamie Foxx posted a couple pictures on Instagram but quickly deleted them. And the post said, tell Spidey let's run it back. Super excited to be part of the new Marvel Spider-Man installment. And I won't be blue in this one, but a thousand percent better. And if you look at the next picture, he posted fan art showcasing Tobey Maguire, Andrew Garfield, and Tom Holland's versions of Spider-Man all going up against Electro, which makes it seem that just like with Tom Hardy posting pictures of Venom eating Spider-Man, hinting towards a Spider-Man vs. Venom movie, Jamie Foxx now confirmed that we could eventually get a live-action Spider-Verse movie. And following the news from Benedict Cumberbatch yesterday that filming for Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness would begin at the end of October or beginning of November, Jeremy Conrad over at the MCU Cosmic stated that on November 27, 2020, Scarlet Witch messes up the multiverse in WandaVision. On December 17, 2021, Spidey deals with the fallout from that, and then on March 25th, 2022, they bring in the big guns to fix it, referring to Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, which could explain why we saw J.K. Simmons, J. Jonah Jameson, Far From Home, and why we're going to see Jamie Foxx's Electro in Spider-Man 3, even though they're both different versions. But then viewer Anon on Twitter said that since we're talking MCU Spider-Man 3 today, I've heard Sony and Marvel's top choice for Kraven, and it's breathtaking. Now whether they actually heard this and Keanu Reeves is a top choice for Kraven the Hunter, or they're making it up, which I doubt they are as they're a relatively reliable source, and Kevin Feige has stated that they talked to Keanu for almost every Marvel movie, we'll have to wait for an official announcement to see if he's playing Kraven or any of the other rumored characters like Ghost Rider or Moon Knight. And lastly, the Falcon of the Winter Soldier completely finished filming in Atlanta, and the crew is already on their way to Prague to officially finish the show, with stunt coordinator Shane Haberstadt and multiple other crew members posting pictures of them on planes heading to the Czech Republic. But let me know what you guys think about all this. Do you think that J.K. Simmons, J. Jonah Jameson, and Jamie Foxx's Electro will eventually be revealed as the original versions that somehow traveled over to the MCU? Would you like to see Keanu Reeves as Kraven the Hunter? And what role do you think WandaVision and Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness will play in Spider-Man 3? If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on post notifications so you'll never miss another video. Thanks for watching, and remember to wash your hands and stay safe.